I don't look like my friends We all are different God made us special and unique Yeah We come from different places We all have different faces There's no one in the world like me Just like a rainbow We are so beautiful On my head, God said each one he counted. I think that means he cares a lot. A lot, lot. Uh, and I know it doesn't matter. Walking or in a wheelchair, I am his child and I am loved. So I trust him. No matter what. question. How many of you have looked in a mirror before? Oh wow, so many of you. We look in the mirror when we brush our teeth, when we brush our hair, but today I have to look in a mirror to do a self-portrait for school. That means I have to draw a picture of myself. These pictures are going to be hung up in the school hallway, so it has to be my best. Okay, to draw myself a portrait, I have to look in the mirror and draw what I see. I have an oval face. I have two eyes. Now I have to draw my hair. That's going to be hard. 
I have a lot of hair. Who? Who? It's Ollie! Hello, Peyton. Who? Who? Looking in the mirror, are you? Hi, Ollie. I'm doing a self-portrait for class, and I'm trying to draw every hair on my head. You have a lot of hairs. It's true. I know someone who can count them all. Who? Who? Just listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. Hola, friends. I'm Luis the Handyman. I'm cleaning up with this brush. It's so important because it keeps my workbench clean. <laughs> Look at all these bristles. There are so many, I don't think I could count them all. That reminds me of today's true story from the Bible. Would you like to help me build it? Great! Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer! Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. We have been learning that God made everything in the whole wide world including you. It's true. God made you, and you are so important to Him. You are so important to God that He knows how many hairs are on your head. Huh. Do you think we could count how many hairs are on this person's head? Let's count. Ready? One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ugh. Oh, wow. There are so many hairs on his head. I don't think we could ever count them all. Hmm. You know, I've never even thought about counting how many hairs are on my head. Oh, but God knows how many there are because. I am so important to him, and so are wonderful you. In fact, you are important to God no matter where you are. You are important to God at the... What do you think this is? <laughs> That's right, the playground. You are important to God when you're at the playground. Let's do another one. You are important to God at the... That's right, the doctor's office. You are important to God when you are at the doctor's office. Let's do one more. You are important to God. Ha <laughs> ha you got it. You are important to God when you are asleep on your bed at night. <laughs> you are important to God no matter where you are. And you are also important to God no matter what you do. You are important to God if you are singing loud. You are important to God if you are reading a book. You are important to God if you are waiting at the end of the line. You are important to God even if you're doing nothing at all. You are important to God no matter where you are and no matter what you do. You are so important to God that He sent His Son, Jesus, to show you how to live and to be your friend forever. <laughs> I am so glad that we are important to God and that He made each one of us wonderful. Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who made you wonderful? God made me wonderful. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me. Who made you wonderful? God made me wonderful. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you next time. Adios! Oh. 
So there's your story, and it's all true. You're important to God, no matter what you do. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, it's so cool to know that God knows everything about us, even the numbers of hairs we have on our head. We're that important to him. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good. I can't possibly draw every hair in my head, but it's cool to know that God knows them. No matter how this self-portrait turns out, I'm still important to God. See you next time. Bye! Fearfully and wonderfully made. Psalm 139 14. I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Psalm 139 14.